Well, it's a basic uh, way in which we survive. I mean, uh, what I mean by cooperation is that you, you work with other people to do things that you can't do for yourself. And from the beginning of life, we have to, a baby has to work with others to, to, to feed itself. It's how we, we learn in schools from adults and so on. I mean, it's a natural phenomenon. What I would say is that the economic crisis we're living through is a crisis of finance capitalism, which is a mono monopolistic phenomenon in the world. But one of its consequences has been within organizations to decrease the amount of cooperation between uh, people and, co and organizations. Uh, the problem is it has an economic itself consequence, which is lowered productivity. People don't work well together. The organizations are unproductive. Well, in my view, we have to in part modify this by, by really rejecting some of the tenets of neoliberalism. That is, we have to reject the notion that we run economies for the sake of markets. I don't know if we're panacea, you know? I'm not that kind of writer who says, here is a problem, I have the solution. I, I don't think that way. But I want the reader to come with me in this book into seeing how the economic crisis produced a social crisis and how exiting from the economic crisis we have to recover certain kinds of social skills. We have to. Well, in my book I try to, to explain the ways in which people become more sophisticated in cooperating, rather than less innocent. And that means learning ways of, of listening to others, of ways of expressing uh, themselves, uh, of identifying who the other is who's speaking, that make us more attentive to difference, more sophisticated uh, when we actually act with other people. Well, we'd be able better to deal with the environmental crisis. Uh, we've reached the project of, of upward mobility is, I think, for the time finished in global economy. And that means that the ones who have not become global need other kinds of strategies in order to survive together. And cooperative movements seem to me to be one strategy that they can use in order uh, to survive well uh, rather than move upward socially. <laughs>